Okay, so funny thing I actually did for this video. I got some random booster boxes I had, so I actually don't know what bays we're gonna get. I, I, I put way too much effort into these videos, but um, LEGO random booster, this video basically justifies me being a LEGO base clone. Um, so we have three bays. Th this is three. Um, we got... What is this intro, dude? We have a Hyperion recolor, a Minoboros recolor, and the prize bay is Hero Hercules. So, yeah, this is gonna be pretty cool. We're gonna start with this guy right here. So here is the uh, box. I like 28, 6, that's a 6, 20, 26. That's what that is. I can't read. Uh, well, we're just gonna get started. Oh, wait, first, what do you think it is? Okay, I feel like it's Minoboros. Oh, no, it's Hyperion. All right, cool. So, here is the Hunter Hyperion recolor layer. Now, you guys might have remembered this uh, from this, like, uh, community post I made, like, a while ago um, when I made a bay in studio. And uh, there's a couple changes. Really, it's just um, these parts are not 1x4 gray plates, and they actually have a little bit of texture. And I moved the gray to these brackets instead. Now, besides the recolor, Hyperion is actually a really good layer. Um, attack is really powerful. It has these, like, moving wings, which don't do much besides potentially fly out in battle, which is not what it's supposed to do. But, hey, you can have, like, an upper attack if you feel like it. It doesn't do much again, but, hey, it's there. Um, but, overall, I'd say that I highly recommend building this bay. It's really good for beginners. It performs well. It's simple. And we are moving on to the chassis. Which is also very simple, but very effective. This is 1S dash. Not 1S dash, this is 1A dash. Um, but yeah, it has the two large blades at the top and the um, much like smaller ones at the sides. And it also matches up with the um, Beat Saber themed colors, which is um, pretty cool. And finally, we have the driver, which is High Mobius. Basically, the idea is that every bay will have a new part of some kind in my boosters. And in this case, it's High Mobius. Now, why did I make a high version of Mobius? Well, if you guys have seen the original Last List for you review, you know that I made that um, Mobius driver very short because of the relative height of um, Last List for his chassis. So I made the driver shorter, but I made a taller version right here. And it's also like much calmer for some reason. Maybe this piece is like rounder or something, but that completes our combo um, Hunter Hyperion. 1A dash high Mobius. It's probably like the best pull um, in this random booster, I'd say. I don't know why I'm treating it like it's a real random booster. It's not, but you know what? I don't care. It's a cool recolor. Moving on, we got this one right here. So, I think this is Hercules. Yeah, it's Hercules. Okay. I just heard like a really loud layer, so I knew it was this, um, a really heavy layer. So, yeah, here is Hero Hercules. Ray. Now, since this is the prize bay, we're going to go a little bit more in-depth with how this thing works. So, I'm going to take off this rubber band and check out the mechanism, which is quite simple, but it is very effective. And I'm kind of surprised that people haven't, like, used um, this kind of idea for Hercules. They only use it for, like, reboot or generate. But, we have a 4x4, these parts on the bottom to add the driver. This is the driver. Uh, because it's a fuse layer and chassis because it's so thick. Um, and then we have some upwards facing brackets for these spiky contact points. And then these, um, hooks right here to keep the rubber band in place. And also a 2x4 right here, you know, just because. And then for the, um, contact points that move around, we have these 2x4 brackets, a 1x2 with these bars at the sides, these slopes, because that looks cool, um, some round contact points right here, and, um, some more hooks, again, to keep the rubber band in place. So we slide both of them in. And since there's a little space in the middle, we can add this 2x2 two two, and then a 2x4 with some details at the top right here. And we have our um, layer. Oh yeah, and we of course add the rubber band, which this basically helps with the kind of springiness. So as you know, Hercules' gimmick, I'll just grab mine right here, is that um, these blades will come out when it's spinning fast, but then go back in when it slows down. Same idea here, except they go out, like, a lot, so, yeah, that might boost attack or something, but when I tested it, it didn't really do that much in the attack department, so, um, yeah, it's supposed to help with, like, stamina or something like that, I don't know. Moving on to the driver, which is Ray, it's a plus tip with a wide disc, 
pretty basic but you know what screw it it has a gimmick you can make it do that i guess i don't i don't know it's just a thing you can do if you want to do it but um yeah that is um hero hercules if you guys have seen the short that i made you probably knew that that was the gimmick but if you didn't hero hercules moving on to the last one which is miniboros now the layer itself is a really nice kind of like charcoal fire thing cool thing recolor or something i don't know um but it's based off of the single layer miniboros stickers which were like black and the horns were on fire and it looked awesome so i based the recolor off of that um color uh design and I'm a big fan of this recolor. I specifically recolor Miniboros. I, I was originally going to do a Lucifer recolor based off of Astral Fafnir um, from Random Booster 27. But then I realized I should make a recolor of Miniboros because the original Miniboros uses brown plastic. Which the problem with that is that it breaks very easily um, for some reason. So yeah, this should be much stable. And I might just use this recolor for like my normal videos or whatever. The chassis is nothing special. It's um, 1B. This was inevitable to get a recolor, but it does look nice. It's really only good on Helios, though. And it has some big recoil points on right spin bays, but it shouldn't be that big of a problem. And it looks like when you orient it like this, um, it hides most of the big recoil points. And we have the driver Quick, which is a driver that LEGO Bays made in his random booster. Huh. But anyways, um... It's a fast attacking driver. It's kind of like a mix between plastic and rubber. High friction plastic or low friction rubber. It's one of those two things. I don't know. I'm no rocket scientist. But um, I don't know how it's going to perform because it does have a bit of friction and these babes are kind of light. But maybe it'll be good. Huh? You never know. Um, testing will be done. But before we do that, let's get to the test battles, which I bet all of you have skipped to already. Let's go. All right. So we're, of course, going to start off with Hercules because it's the main band of set. So that was a bad launch. Let's try it again. Alright, so if you can see, it's kind of like wider, but as the bay slows down, it's, it gets smaller. That, that's such a cool thing to do. Um, I'm actually gonna do a quick um, uh, modification to this thing, because for some reason this plate is very like... It doesn't grip well on the launcher, so I'm gonna switch it out real quick. That's much better. Apparently not. Hold on. Oh, there it is. Look at how wide it is. Look at that. It's going. And now it's small. It's so cool to watch. Alright. Now let's do, um, Minaboros. Alright, pretty fast, pretty fast. If it doesn't have too much stamina, that doesn't mean the driver is bad. It's just that the layer is off balance, but it looks really nice while it's in. Alright, cool. And Hyperion. Like, it's going fast, but most defense drivers do that. Like, it's not going too crazy, and it kind of appears purple in real life. Well, now, how's it look on camera? It's kind of purple on camera. That's pretty interesting. Alright. So, with that out of the way, let's do the test battle. So, we're going to get these two out of the way first, of course. I'm a big fan of the um, Hyperion recolor, actually. I think it looks really nice. It tried to come back, but it doesn't stand a chance. Hyperion is too solid, man. This is too good. Alright, three, two, one. Beyblade. Burst. Beyblade double burst. Wow. Speaking of three, two, one, go shoot, have you guys seen the teaser um, for uh, March 31st? I think that's pretty cool. Um, but Beyblade leaks aside. Um, let's do one more battle, and then we'll battle them both against, uh, whatever. That was a weak launch. He's gonna die anyway. Alright, yeah, you know what? Oh, thinking of, but, you know what? The main bay, of course. Um, I expect this thing to be a pretty solid stamina type. We'll do it against Hyperion first. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. I don't know if I already said that. What was that launch? Hold up. Run that back. Go. Shoot. Go. Shoot. It kind of like acts like defense. It kind of like um, cushions attacks in a way. Ah, uh, Hyperion. Well, yeah, because that was the Mobius driver. 
Alright, let's do that again. Hey, what is up with these launches, bro? Oh! What just happened? Hyperion Bird. Oh, and Hercules is fine. Alright. These wings. Look at this. That looks so cursed. Um, but yeah, nice burst from Hercules. We'll do. You know what? Screw it. We'll do another battle. These battles are pretty cool, not gonna lie. They're really cool. Okay, three, two, one, so two. Another burst. Awesome. Alright. Uh, granted, the hype, this Hyperion recolor does have kind of like weak teeth for some reason. I don't know why. But um, yeah, another win for Hercules. Let's do um, it against Minoboros now. Alright, three, two, one, go. Shoot! That one hit sent it flying. Alright, yeah, I think Minoboros might actually be really good. I'm gonna have to do some testings after this video. But, um, yeah, let's, let's go again. That was awesome. That's not awesome. I'm getting stuck on my launcher? Bro. Look at that. Again, I'm surprised that people haven't, like, came up with something like that. Alright, we're gonna actually make it, like, high now. We're gonna do that, and we're gonna see, um, how it does. It did that. Somehow. Okay, sure. Okay, we're gonna do, like, one more battle, and then I think we're gonna end it off. Wait, it go Oh, it, 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 it. I don't know what happened there. I don't know if... Okay, so... Uh... <laughs> My brain is trying to process this. Um, do a slow-mo. Um, slow-mo that so we know who won. Okay, um... So, Minivoros burst. But... You know what? That was the video. I'll, I'll let you guys decide who won that one. Um, so... If you enjoyed this video, comment, like, subscribe, do whatever you want. If I will do another one of these, comment down below what kinds of recolors you want and what bays I should recolor. But, see you in the next video.